Good evening. Today I'll talk about how to apply Angel Granger two step method of co integration in R Studio. I have already discussed about introduction of co integration. In this video, I'll talk about how to apply it. I have data set of paper price which includes black paper and white paper. So now before going for Angel Granger 2 step, we have to ensure that our series must be integrated at same order. In my case, black paper and white paper are integrated at first difference. So now I'm going to explain with the help of two step. A step first and a step second. A step first talks about store the value of error term or residual. Then a step a step second talks about test the stationarity of that particular error term. So talking about first step, we need DYNLM package. So simply I have already installed DYNLM package. I'm going to load it in library and then DYNLM enter now it is loaded after loading dynlm i'm going to save the dynamic linear model in any particular model so i write here model 1 equal to dynlm and black paper on the basis of white paper enter now we have model 1 which includes dynamic linear model between black paper and white paper after writing this we can save the residual value of paper price so simply I write here race, race underscore paper price equal to residuals and model 1. Enter. Now residual of model 1 has been stored in race underscore paper price. So step number first is done here. Let's talk about step number two. In step number two, we test the stationarity of that particular error term. For the same, we can install Urka package and load it in library. I have already installed Urka package. So simply I load it in library urca which is urca package and then enter. After writing this simply I write simply I write here ur dot df and residual of paper price press enter. This is the output of augmented Dickey Fuller test and or we can say co-integration test. So what is null hypothesis? Null hypothesis is there is no co-integration in between black paper and white paper. If calculated T statistic is greater than 1.96 or near to 2, our null hypothesis 
is failed to accept. It means our null hypothesis is rejected. The T statistic value is 4.2472. We have to see absolute value. Hence, 4.2472 is greater than 1.96. And we can say that our null hypothesis is rejected. So, simply you can say there is co-integration in between black paper and white paper. That is all about Angel Granger co-integration test. Thank you very much.